in this lecture we're going to talk about what are cross functional process maps and how to use them to imbibe accountability and ownership so largely in the context of providing clarity of responsibility this tool is a very very powerful tool I'm sure all of you must have seen process maps in your organization and you must have seen that because you want to know what the process is or you want your guys to get trained on the process so that they do it well etc I'm not going to talk about process maps in that context but I'm going to talk about it in the context of accountability and responsibility and that's also the reason that I'm not going to deep dive and talk about how to do it but I'm going to talk about how to interpret it now here what you see is a cross-functional process map a generic map which talks about various functions and let's say a customer is generating a complaint or a feedback and how that feedback flows from the customers right into the organization it moves across various stakeholders and then finally you have a resolution you go back to the customer and report that and close the issue now we will talk about various aspects here which are very critical for you as a leader to interpret now the point where there is an interaction between the customer and the organization 